What's up guys? It's Michaela. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a part two to my taking marine biology quizzes. I did this, oh god, it had to be like May of 2020, earlier into the pandemic. But you guys really seemed to like it, so why not do a part two? But before I get started, with the video, I wanted to ask you guys something. So I have been thinking about starting a Patreon for marine biology, but I wanted to get your guys' feedback if you would join or if you wouldn't join, what you would wanna see on my Patreon. I get so many DMs about marine biology questions and internships and what I did to get to university or what universities are good for marine biology. And I thought it would be really cool to have that all on one little community platform. And I've seen a couple other marine biology people do Patreon and I thought, why not try it? Obviously, I don't wanna try it unless you guys want it. So there I would probably do live streams. I would do posts about universities, different posts about stuff going on in the marine biology community and the marine mammalogy community, just a whole world of people who love marine biology so if you guys are interested in that please 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 let me know because i want to put it on my february goals list to get up and running by the end of february so please 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 either message me on instagram comment down below let me know in some way shape or form please i would really appreciate it because i really want to get this started so with that all being said i hope you guys enjoy and let's dive in so i'm going to be doing the same thing i did in the last video i'm going to be screen recording my phone and taking some quizzes so let's get this started all right the first one is from marinebio.org so maybe that one could possibly be good did i take this last time maybe i think i took maybe one of these last time let's do shark species if you guys know marine mammals are up here sharks are right below them i love sharks so let's go ahead and start this sand shark well, it's a sand tiger shark, but they they didn't put the tiger, so I'm, I'm I'm gonna say no. Yay! It's a sand tiger shark. I thought they were tricking me. Copper shark? No, that looks like a bull shark. I didn't even know that there was a copper shark. Okay, moving on. Mako shark. There's two different types of mako sharks? Oh lord. Uh, I'm gonna go with sh I meant to put short. Gosh darn it. Wongong shark. Spotted Wongong shark. I keep forgetting there are like 400 plus species of sharks and I don't know them all so. Oopsies. Piked dogfish. Yes, that is a dogfish. Dogfish are technically sharks, if you guys didn't know. Frilly shark. See, I don't know what this is. Yay, I guessed, but I got it right, so that's all that counts. Small tooth sand tiger shark. I've never heard of that, but apparently it's a thing. Epulet shark. That is an epulet. No, I meant to put, I meant to put yes, and I know it's an epulet shark because it has that like big spot halfway through its body. Epulet sharks are so beautiful, and I'm so mad at myself because I meant to put yes. There's 49 questions. I don't think we're gonna be doing this entire quiz. Hammerhead shark. That kind of looks like a bonnet head. Oh, look at me go! Swell shark. Yes, yay. Leopard shark, yes, yay. Whale shark, yes. What? Whaler shark, I hate this quiz. Six gill shark, yes. Blue shark, no, oh, well. Sandbar shark, yes. Taupe shark, what is a taupe shark? Yes, yay. 
reef shark. It doesn't say what type of reef shark. So, black tip reef shark. Yes. Woo. Seven gill shark. Don't know what that is, but seven gills. You know what? I hate this quiz. We're done with this quiz. All I have concluded from that quiz is I need to brush up on my shark anatomy. All right, let's try marine biology fun facts. 10 questions. 10 questions is doable. The plant classification of these critters produces 90% of the world's oxygen. I want to say it's plankton. Wait. Oh, okay. It doesn't say if it's wrong or right. Okay. Famously friendly in TV shows and movies, bottlenose dolphins and all dolphins are really classified in the same order as... Are whales and dolphins in the same order? I want to say... No, because they're delphinidae. Is that the order? Oh. I'm just going to say whales because... All dolphins are whales, but not all whales are dolphins. So, a lot of people know what seahorses look like, but what more general group of organisms do they belong to? I want to say they're fish. Real sea sponges are great for bathing and painting, but what kind of critter are they? They're an animal. I think a sponge is an animal. It's living, right? I don't know. Sea urchins, starfish, and sea cucumbers all belong to the phylum Echinodermata. If dermata refers to skin, what does echino mean? Oh, oh, I learned about this in marine biology. Echino, I want to say it's spined. I'm going to say spined. Some fish can change sex from male to female or vice versa. That is true. Take a look at Nemo, for example. The largest structure created by non-human organisms is a type of what? Coral reef. The largest compound eye of any organism on the plant belongs on the planet belongs to what deep sea dweller? I want to say the giant squid. I think their eye is like the size of a basketball. As depicted in Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End, the kraken is said to be what type of mollusk? Go a cephalopod. I don't even know. I haven't seen the Pirates of the Caribbean. Any of them. Are there any marine reptiles? Yes, there are. I'm scared to click submit. Okay, I got... I got a 10 out of 10! The average is a 7 out of 10, and I got a 10! Yay me! <laughs> Let's go ahead and do, what do you know about marine biology? What do, what do most scientists think that life started in the ocean? Why do most scientists, oh. Why do most scientists think that life started in the oceans? Did I get it right? Oh, cool, I got it. What causes ocean tides? It's the moon. Oh, it's the moon and the sun. Cool. What is an ecosystem? Um, a community of organisms that depend on each other and their surroundings. Ha ha, go me. What can, where can you find the greatest diversity of life on earth? In your bathroom, that is Definitely right. <laughs> in the oceans. What is plankton? Small floating animals and algae that live in the ocean, pieces of dead wood that float, ocean plants that sink in heavy storms. Small floating, this is like overly easy. What is the biggest animal that ever lived? The blue whale, woo. What is bioluminescence? Ooh, glowing lights on animals' bodies. Where can you find 80% of all ocean life? In the deep sea. No. Oh, on the continental shelves. In Florida, how freaking stupid. Below 2,000 feet, the ocean is completely dark. These are really way too easy. The biggest threat to the ocean is killer bees. Human beings. I got eight out of 10. Sweet. Okay, we're gonna take one more. Hopefully, 
it's a little bit harder. Okay, so I found this one. It has a 77% average accuracy. So let's go. There's 12 questions. What is the deepest part of the ocean? The Marianas Trench, I think. Wait, do it, how do I answer it? Are you serious? See answers with a free account? I'm not doing this. We're just gonna take another quiz. Ooh, this one is, okay. I looked up marine mammals quiz and this one says only one in 20 people can name each of these marine mammals from one image. Okay, I wanna do that one and then I'm gonna go up to the Noah one because I wanna do the Noah one too. But let's start with this one. Oh, this is gonna be so, so easy, but whatever, okay. Which marine mammal is this? Walrus. Okay. Oh my God, this has to be. <sighs> okay. Wow, okay. Oh, this is so easy. Oh my gosh, this is so incredibly easy. Hi, hey. These are so easy. I'm just doing this to make myself feel better about the other quizzes that I've taken. Oh, the Vaquita. So cute. Um, sea whale. See, it would be more hard if they put like Say Whale, Brutus Whale, Minky Whale, and Blue Whale. Like seriously, that's a harp seal. No one's gonna get that. Which marine mammal is this? Leopard seal. How many are there? Which marine mammal is this? That is a beaked whale. Which marine mammal is this? How many of these are there? Oh my gosh. Whoa, that's cool. It's an hourglass dolphin. That's a really cool dolphin. I didn't even know that existed. Um, melon-headed whale. How many are there? Oh my gosh. Which marine mammal is this? How many of these questions are there? This is a northern right whale dolphin. Which marine mammal is this? That's a spinner dolphin from Hawaii. Um, uh, minky whale. Minky whale's breath smell awful. That's why they're called stinky minkies. Which marine mammal is this? That is a bearded seal. Which marine mammal is this? This is a Hawaiian monk seal. First off, um, I don't know if that's in an aquarium or if it's in the wild, but you, if this is in the wild, that photographer was far too close to the Hawaiian monk seal. Just saying. Which marine mammal is this? That is a spotted seal. Okay. How many more of these are there? I am not doing this. I think I get a 100 on this quiz. Now we're going to the Noah quiz and this is the last quiz I'm gonna do. Take our marine mammals quiz. Okay. We're gonna take the one from Noah and let's hope that it is a little bit harder than the last one. Which seal has the nickname horse head because of the long straight slope of its profile, which makes it look horse-like? I wanna say a gray seal. That's correct, woo, okay, cool. Which whale produces the sound heard in this audio clip? Oh, you guys probably won't be able to hear it. I can't find it. All right, we're gonna guess on that one. And we're gonna guess humpback whale because that is the whale that has the most unique sound. Way to go. I'm so 
So predictable. How can you tell the difference between a dolphin and a porpoise? It essentially comes down to the shape of their face, their fins, and their body shape. Is this a dolphin or a porpoise? That's a dolphin. Woo. I, I'm a genius. I should just have my degree right now. I'm just kidding. That's a lie. Which of these whales is one of the world's most endangered large whale species throughout its range? Um, that's the North Atlantic right whale. I don't even have to see the options to know that answer. Woo. I'm listening to a conference right now. It's muted so I could film this video. But one of the marine biologists was just talking about the Northern Atlantic right whales. Which special ability do dolphins and toothed whales have to locate and see their food underwater? That is echolocation. Which of these whales weighs the most? That is the blue whale, because it is the largest animal on Earth. Next. Pupping season is the time when seals give birth and care for their young pups. Where do harbor seals along the East Coast pup? That's a good question. I want to say New England. Yay! Either I'm smart or I'm a really good guesser. To feed some whales use baleen to strain small, mostly microscopic organisms from the ocean. Baleen is strong and flexible, blah, 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 blah. What do you think baleen whales eat? They are eating krill, small fish, copepods, and other zooplankton. That's correct. Of course it's correct. Molting is a biological process where an animal routinely casts off different parts of their body, blah, 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 blah. What do you think? Do seals molt? Yes, seals actually do molt, and it is kind of disturbing, but it's actually really cute. <laughs> Thanks so much for testing your marine mammal skills. Submit. View score. I got 15 out of 15 points. I'm a genius. That was it for my taking marine biology quizzes part two. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed Some of those quizzes were not the hardest and I'm mainly focused on sharks and marine mammals in this one. So I hope you guys liked it. Maybe I'll do a part three with like sea turtles and pinnipeds, we'll see. But like I said in the beginning of this video, please let me know how you guys feel about me starting up a Patreon. It would not be very much, maybe less than $5 a month for the first like kind of tier and then it would go up from there. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked it, hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.